This video will show you how you can add your OG Ads Content Locker to your WordPress site. So here's my example site here. I'm going to show you how you can create a Content Locker and add it to WordPress. So first we're going to log into OG Ads. And then once we're inside of the OG Ads dashboard, we can now go to Tools and then Content Lockers. Once you're here, you can then create a Content Locker. So we'll create a Content Locker. I'll enter in the name or just call it I'll just call it YouTube example for the name and I'm not going to leave any notes or anything like that. Uh, for the load method, we're going to keep it on on load. So when the page loads, the content locker will appear. I'm not going to have any uh, load delay on the unlock action. I want the locker to be removed. And if I go to advanced here, we can see that one conversion and one offer is required. If we go to desktop specific, we can choose the theme. For this video, this isn't gonna be really how you can create one. It's more of a how to add it to a WordPress tutorial. So I'll keep this all the same and we'll create this locker. So now this locker has been created, we can now go to actions and we can now view the details of this locker. Now we can go ahead and enable ad block detection and enable JavaScript detection. And you then want to copy this script here. Now go back to your WordPress website, go into your WordPress dashboard, and this is very simple from here. Now on the left hand side, you want to scroll down and you want to go to appearance. And then you want to find theme file editor or theme editor, click on that. And then once you're in here, you want to scroll down on the theme files, and you're looking for header.php. So click on header.php. Then if you scroll down, you should see head. So just under the head, open him, click enter like three times to create some new lines, paste in this code. So paste in the in this code, scroll down, click update file, just wait for that to update here file edited successfully, we can now visit our site. And we should be able to see the contents of the site, then the content locker appears. That's how you do it. I hope that video did help you out.